Good morning, everybody. I hope you're having a wonderful Wednesday. I decided to video inside today because it's just hot out there already. And y'all keep us in your prayers for safety this afternoon because we got to go get hay for the winter out of the hay field. And I'm just a little concerned because of how hot it is because we don't need anybody falling out or passing out because of the heat. So we are here today. Hey, Mom, thank you for joining me. We are here today to talk about HD Clear, which um, I've learned a lot about this oil already. Even though we had it on hand, I personally haven't used this one as much as my kids have used it. And the reason is, is because it's part of the HD Clear skincare line. It's three components, um, the wash, the oil, and the lotion. And you can get these as a bundle or you can get them separately. So today, we're mostly just going to focus on this oil. And this is a 10 milliliter roller bottle. So those of you who don't know, if you haven't experienced a roller bottle, see it has a ball and you just roll it on your skin. So this one is formulated specifically for topical use. It's not for internal use. And you could use it aromatically, but it's going to be hard to use in your diffuser. If We're going to talk about that a little bit more in a minute, though. So let's talk about the blend that is created for this. This is created specifically because the oils in here have unique abilities to protect the skin from bacteria and fungal proliferation. And it also helps with acne and eczema. So your main things that you're going to be using this on are acne, eczema, calluses. It works good on calluses, dermatitis, impetigo, and if you have oily skin, this is the skincare line you're going to want to keep on hand in addition to the Virage or the Essentials skin care because this is formulated to help with oily skin. So you're going to be applying it topically, like I said, to acnes and pimples, the areas of concern, and you're just going to be rolling it or dabbing it on those areas. It's also good, like I said, for oily skin, or if you have areas that are prone to overactive oil glands, those are called sebaceous glands, and it can help with that if they produce too much oil. So for your skin blemishes and your irritations, dermatitis, eczema, and fungal and bacteria issues. So a little life hack for this, if you battle um, fingernail fungus or toenail fungus, you can use your HD Clear for that because it's formulated specifically for that. So the oils that are in here, so it's got a carrier oil in it. However, the carrier oil for this is not fractionated coconut oil. It is black cumin seed oil. Black cumin seed oil only has trace amounts of essential oil in it. It's a carrier oil. I've been reading about it and learning a lot. Uh, it's been used over 2,000 years for a whole bunch of health issues. But the reason it's been selected to put into this is two primary reasons. First of all, it has been shown in studies to be effective against bacteria that is antibiotic resistant. So we know that in the news media as um, superbugs, they're resistant to antibacteria. So 
black cumin seed oil has been shown to be effective against superbugs. That's the first reason it's in there. And the second reason that it's in there is because it has a very high content of lino, I don't know how to say it, linoleic acid, which is an essential fatty acid that is necessary for healthy hair and skin and nails. And it's been studied for its ability to reduce acne and promote cellular recovery from the acne site because, you know, that's, that's a little mini volcano of inflammation and those cells are very upset and excited. So they need to be able to calm down and recover. And it, it's um, like a wound. So the black cumin seed oil has been shown to be very effective in cellular regeneration for wound healing. So the essential oils that are in this, hoewood, Hoe wood is known specifically for its antiseptic properties and has been used to clear skin and revitalize skin tissue. Melaleuca, also known as tea tree oil, is one of the most studied antibacterial and antifungal oils. It's one of my favorites to clean with because it's antifungal, antibacterial, and antiviral. It does all three of those. It also has anti-inflammatory properties and it helps to calm down the skin and support the healing process. It also has litsia in it. Now litsia is one that if you were living in Australia and New Zealand, you could get litsia on a regular basis because it's in the market for doTERRA over there. We only get it in blends and every so often when they let us have it in single oils. I have one bottle of Litsia single oil um, and it's very precious to me because I know how hard it is to get it since it's not in the US market all the time. But Litsia has, and I didn't know this about Litsia, it has antiseptic and astringent properties and is therefore very good for oily skin and acne. What I have used Litsia for is insect repellents. The bugs don't like it. So if this also has eucalyptus in it, and which is good for the inflammation of the skin and sores. I didn't know this. Eucalyptus is used medicinally in France to treat candida infections and other fungal infections. And geranium is in here. Geranium has antibacterial and anti-inflammatory properties and is often used to, to help relieve acne and eczema. It also helps to balance the oil levels in your skin. So, one thing we have talked a bit before about oils being so wonderful because they don't have side effects, they have side benefits. So there is a wonderful side benefit to this essential oil blend. So it was created in mind with you know, dealing with things that rise to the surface and become an issue with our face, but emotionally, this blend um, is calming and cleansing to the emotions. So if you have or if you know someone who kind of represses emotions and then they just boil to the surface and erupt, emotionally this is the oil for that. And so for emotional issues, it's always best to use aromatherapy. So you can use aromatherapy just by rolling this in your hand and then inhaling it. I'm going to do that because it smells good. Mm. It is very cleansing and refreshing. 
or if you wanted to be able to use it in your diffuser, what I would recommend is recycling one of your 15 milliliter bottles and just pouring it in there and peel the label off and stick it on that 15 milliliter bottle so that you know that it's HD clear and just use it that way from your diffuser. So hope that gives you some good information about HD clear. If you learned something in today's video, be sure to comment about it and we will focus on this oil and these other two parts of this skincare system in the rest of the days this week until next Wednesday. And don't forget about Tuesday BOGOs. It's so exciting. I like doing the BOGOs this way just once a week on Tuesdays and I love that they're telling us what they are on Monday so we have time to prepare and spread the word. Also don't forget about the lottery tickets for the backpack with over $500 worth of doTERRA goodies that Stephanie is um, fundraising for the family in need because we're about halfway to the goal that we have for that and it's a really 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 good deal. I myself got $40 worth of tickets because there's a lot of good stuff in that backpack. So if you haven't done that yet make sure that you contact her for some tickets. Okay? I'll see y'all next week. Bye. Hey, Denise. Thank you for joining me. I have come to the end, so you'll have to watch the replay. Bye.